Uh, yeah, this is Jeff Grant and I'm Daniel Howard. Uh, but when we perform together, we're known as Jeffrey and Ivory. <laughs> so, um, yeah, this is a duet we wrote. This is a song about being white. <laughs> because I was born white, life is pretty great. I don't have to deal with some of the challenges other people deal with every day. I can go and live and work wherever I please with less chance of people having prejudice towards me. And while it seems I won the genetic lottery by being born this way, there is still one thing that I must never ever say. This taboo word for whites, you might figure the word that I must never ever ever say is new. <laughs> Get my Food Network show taken away. I can't say, nigga. Even if I'm quoting the movie Django Unchained. I can't say, nigga. Unless I want to shorten my life expectancy. I can't say, nigga. Even though I have one black friend, I can't say, nigga. Even if I had a black girlfriend, but it, yeah, she better not. But it's, but it's not like I haven't had a black girlfriend because I'm not attracted to black women or something. I just don't know how to talk to them. Ooh, 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 ooh. I can't say. Even if I had a distant black relative Unless it's relative enough to show through my skin That word must not leave these honky cracker lips I can say, nigga Even if I adopted a black kid Like Brad and Angelina did Ethiopian baby, Ethiopian baby, Ethiopian baby I can't say, nigga. Even if I'm driving alone, listening to Jay Z, got 99 problems. But just kidding, I don't. I'm white. We don't have that many problems. All right. Stick it to the bridge. Black people have such a kinship by saying my nigga to each other. But if I were to try to say my nigga, I would sound like a slave owner. So it doesn't matter if I pronounce it nigga or nigger. I won't say that word unless I want to end my life premature. Jeff Grant, say it for me. Thank you, everybody. Give it up for my nigga, Jeff Grant.